Thank you. It is 6.01 now new this morning. New economic numbers released Tuesday show inflation, while still high, could be easing. Those in NECAC say that could help people who are struggling to make ends meet, but it does need to drop further to really impact those bills. WGEM's Ryan Hill joins us now live on Hannibal with more on that. Ryan, good morning. Good morning. Now, officials at NECAC tell me poverty levels in the region have remained stable, between 11 and 14 percent, depending on the county. But they are seeing a lot more people who are at risk slipping into poverty, reaching out for assistance. NECAC Public Relations Officer Brent Engel says a lot of first-time clients are coming in utilizing their services across northeast Missouri. He says their utility assistance program, for an example, normally gets less than 100 applicants, depending on the weather, but it's a different story this year. In the first four months of the fiscal year, which began October 1st, we are up more than 500 applications from the same period the year before. Uh, One-fifth of that is in Marion County alone. 115 more applications uh, for the first four months of this year compared to last year. He says more families are living from paycheck to paycheck, and while their wages and jobs might be stable, inflation eats up a lot of their money. Unexpected finances such as medical bills or rising grocery costs can also cut into their budgets. Now, utility bills aren't the only necessity people are spending more money on. We'll hear from a food pantry on what they're seeing in the next half hour. Live in Hannibal, Ryan Hill, WGEM News. Ryan, thank you. And Ingle encourages people who need help to reach out to NECAC. He also urges everyone to fill out the community needs assessment so they can determine the resources needed in the area. We have a link to that on our story at WGEM.com.